Championship bound, dozens of high school students from across Puget Sound are seeking international fame in the first 2022 championship youth robotics competition, which is in Texas. Yeah, teens vying for victory include STEM students from Mill Creek's Henry M. Jackson High School. And Fox 13 Steve Kiggins explains how youth robotics programs like theirs are preparing the next generation of problem solvers. <laughs> It's a send-off fit for a champ. At the center of attention, the H.M. Jackson High School first robotics competition team. I think they're slowly realizing how awesome they are. Since January, dozens of science, technology, engineering, and math students have journeyed on a quest for robotic superiority, manifest in this machine named 2910 Jack in the Bot. Like the drivetrain, like the shooting mechanism, the intaking where like they get the balls into the robot. Honestly, it's both really exciting and also nerve-wracking at the same time. After clinching the Pacific Northwest District Championship, on Wednesday the team prepared for their final battles, where they will test their tech skills alongside and against Obstacle other high school robot clubs, clubs from around the world. Y'all are getting ready to go to Houston to, to compete at the uh, World Robotics Championship, right? Yeah. Awesome. The team at Jackson have devoted evenings and Saturdays since January designing a robot that fires balls into a basket, climbs bars, and more. They're learning engineering principles and programming skills and uh, graphic design and media skills that go beyond what often we can hit in the classroom. It's those skills the first robotics competition community believes can inspire young people to become innovators and the leaders of tomorrow. I'm not only working with the team, I'm leading the team and I'm teaching the team. And so that, and so I've, so like becoming the teacher was a bit of a big deal. In this community, competition requires cooperation. Success can lead to networking and internships it's where science and tech collide with the excitement of sport. It's a chance where every kid can go pro. It's developing real skills. These two are programmers. I'm using professional CAD programs to uh, design robots. And I mean, these are skills I can take into an industrial workforce. Steve Kiggins, Fox 13 News.